Hi, it's Lightman from Shisha Bucks, and today we're presenting the CloudStorm hookah. CloudStorm is a more traditional style hookah compared to our modern designs, and it features a rotating centerpiece as well as an all anodized aluminum finish. So here's what you should expect in the package. The tray, the four host ports slash purges, the down stem, one piece handle, silicon hose, as well as the stem of the hookah itself. So let's have a quick rundown of the parts that will be included with the hookah. This is the heart, which seats both the stem and the down stem. On this, you put the hose connector, which is the part that swivels, allowing you to rotate the hoses. There is the top piece, which holds the bowl, as well as holds the tray down so it does not rattle. The four modular hose ports, when the silicon along with the ball is included, acts as a purge, but can be easily removed along with the ball to house the hose. The anodized tray, which features a very small curve to keep the ash from falling out. The down stem, which includes a screw and diffuser to help your session be a little bit quieter, as well as a ball inside to keep water from going up the stem. Single piece anodized aluminum handle, as well as a matte silicon hose, which stops any lint or hairs from being stuck to it. And this is how you assemble it. So you start off by holding this. Please note that these do move as they can be replaced or moved. So you have to kind of hold them together as you screw in the heart and top piece. After that's tightened, just hold this down, put the tray on top, and screw in with the top piece. This helps uh, it sandwich the tray down, which keeps them from rattling and makes a really good connection with the top piece of the hookah. The top piece also features four holes which you can use something like an Allen key to thread through to tighten down in order to keep the stem and the tray completely solid. After this, you can assemble the hose. You do this by simply taking one of the perch ports, taking out the silicon as well as the ball and putting this somewhere for safekeeping. You add the hose into the port by simply pushing it in together and twisting in until the end. After this, you insert the tip you've completed the hose. Then we can finish up the putting together the stem by simply threading in the down stem, adding in the three purges, and then finally the hose. As you can see, it fits on a standard large KM base with a 1.75 inch opening. It also fit on the smaller 10 inch bases if you decide to remove the diffuser, and also will fit on the more narrow 1.5 inch openings as the rings can be removed in order to fit the more slim profile. So now we've gone ahead, set up the hookah. Let's see how it smokes. It has the same open draw that you would see with any of our other hookahs as it has the same diameter in the hose, stem and down stem as all our other products. This features a rotating heart which allows you to easily pass around the hose without the stem moving and without the coals or anything moving, which is great for parties or even if you're just smoking with one person to pass it between each other. And we've also worked a lot on the purge on this as the biggest problem with common chamber hookahs is that the base doesn't fully clear during purging. But as you can see here, it purges almost instantly. And also each of these four hose ports can be outfitted with another hose, which is compatible with our Cloud Hose V2, which allows you to smoke with multiple people. Thank you for watching, and the Cloud Storm is available on our website, shishabucks.com.